The Osmo Pocket is a great camera that I find myself using a lot. It's small and it's stabilized. But there is one thing that the Osmo Pocket can't do. And that is to shoot wide angle selfies or just wide angle shots. So this might be DJI's solution to this. Beyond actually releasing another camera, the Osmo Action, you can still use your Osmo Pocket with this DJI Osmo Pocket extension rod that will basically extend the length of which the camera is gonna be from you at around 70 centimeters. That's gonna give you wide angle and today we'll test it out and see if it's worth it or not. So how are you doing my friends? I'm Rotodil and welcome to the channel. I invite you to join my channel by clicking on the red subscribe button down below to see my future gadget reviews. And I actually have some really cool ones coming up. I've been reviewing gadgets for the past couple of years now and you'll be able to see my future gadget adventures just by subscribing. But today we are with the DJI Osmo Pocket extension rod. I'm just gonna pull up my Osmo Pocket here and as you can see I've been using it a lot. Um, I really like the fact that the Osmo Pocket is a small and stabilized camera. It's one of the biggest reasons that I've been using it for the past year. Um, but the fact is like I mentioned before, I don't have the ability to capture wide angle shots. So the extension rod, which is over here, is basically letting me do exactly that. By extending the Osmo Pocket for me at around, uh, for around 70 centimeters, you can get this length away from you. And that's really not bad actually, it's really not bad because um, for taking these selfies or even for thumbnails if you're making videos like me, that's exactly what you need. So one of the most interesting things I found about the extension rod while using it is that I have full controls over the Osmo Pocket. I can actually change its angle or position. I can change the way that the camera is behaving by tilting or maybe changing the actual camera from selfie mode to uh, forward looking mode. I can change the stabilization or the follow mode. I can start recording, stop recording, and I, and I can even turn off um, the Osmo Pocket. And that has basically been done by um, the connectors that you have here on the extension rod that basically transfer all the commands from the handle itself to the Osmo Pocket and I think that's a huge feature, probably the biggest feature here uh, because unlike other products, you usually can't do that and you all the time have to switch back the, uh, whether it's a selfie stick or whatever, just to press on the Osmo Pocket itself or maybe your mobile phone, but in this case you have everything physical over here. You also have the mobile option, the ability to connect your mobile phone and then if you have the wireless model on your Osmo Pocket, I'm just gonna put everything up right now, then you'll be able to see whatever your Osmo Pocket is capturing. And one of the interesting modes you can basically do is like this. You can hold the Osmo Pocket, have the wireless model over here on the bottom, and your mobile phone over here. This way you can capture everything as if it was a stabilized DSLR camera without having all that big rig. But you know what, it's quite big already. So that's something you need to take into concerns because that's one of the things I don't really like about this. Uh, it feels good in the hands, but it's quite big. And if you are using this, for example, uh, tripod mount, because you also have a tripod mount ability over here, the, the Osmo Pocket itself doesn't have um, a tripod screw so you can't screw it in but with this extension rod you get the ability to do that you get an even bigger rig so that's something you really need to take note because if you want to put this in your bag like so this is not going to be protected unless you have the protection head for the camera itself and you should have that I don't have that myself because I only have this right now which is the generic one they gave us when you purchase the product but I plan on getting the one that's basically on the head of the camera itself. So it's huge and that's a minus. Another minus you have with this device is that basically you cannot use as of this time of recording of this video, you cannot use the microphone model with the wireless model because the wireless model, it seems like, doesn't let you connect the microphone USB-C model to it. 
So you'll basically be stuck without the audio. The audio is gonna be able, uh, you basically have to uh, capture the audio on an external device like your mobile phone or an external audio system, which is really weird DJI because we want audio. And if we're talking about audio, by the, by the way, you will see that we have the uh, hot shoe over here, which we can use um, if you have the wireless. Uh, so if you have the microphone model, we can use to basically connect um, our uh, microphone, whether it's a shotgun mic or this mic, which I think is gonna do better, um, the wireless Rode, for example. And then if you have the uh, mic, uh, adapter which I don't have you basically connect the mic adapter to this wireless road over here and then you have great audio you don't have <laughs> monitor because you won't be able to connect your wireless adapter and you also don't have charging for your uh, Osmo pocket so when it dies out on you you won't be able to use it anymore this way but you'll have an awesome rig with great wireless audio and uh, I think you need wireless because with the shotgun mic, even at 70 centimeters, it's a bit too much in many scenarios. This is more professional and you'll be able to use uh, wireless audio just like I'm using right now. Hey guys, so I'm now using the extension rod and I actually placed it on the floor. So that's how I can speak to you guys. And I'm using the built-in microphone of the Osmo Pocket. That basically means that I don't have high quality audio until at least I'll get the uh, mic adapter. But I also want to show you how far away I am when I'm using the extension rod. And to do that, I'll actually point the camera towards me and just change the angle of the extension rod. So that's how much of a distance I can get while using the extension rod. And as you can see, it's kind of giving me the widest angle I could hope for uh, while using this device which isn't supposed to be wide angle at least when I purchased it so I really like that but you still can see my hand and like with any selfie stick that's gonna be a bit of an issue to some of us but the thing is is I just want to show you how it looks like when I don't have the extension rod open yeah it's way too up close as you can see so that's the issue here uh, when you use the Osmo Pocket to take videos of you talking um, like this you're gonna be way too close to the freaking camera you want to use the, this uh, extension mod and it gets the job done really really well so overall for me this is like the biggest Osmo Pocket upgrade that I could purchase um, I kind of felt like when I'm using the Osmo Pocket, most of the time it was for B-roll anyways, or like capturing um, some insane angles uh, for B-roll. So with this extension roll, I can go into places that uh, I didn't, I couldn't go into before. So I like that. But the fact is, you still have problems with it, especially when talking about charging it while it's working. Um, I'm talking about the Osmo Pocket, of course, using wireless um, extension uh, options with the uh, microphone is still a problem, but it gets the job done. It gives you the wide angle you want, and that's, for me, enough. So that's why I have it. And also the tripod is a good touch. I think you can put it anywhere and basically create your own studio. You can just like extend it to whatever, um, height you want for like about 70 centimeters gonna be the maximum but if you put it on a table it's gonna be good enough for you to capture like a head talk video so I like it a lot overall I think it's a huge upgrade probably the best one you could get right now um, especially when you know that the microphone adapter is not good enough by itself or the wireless is not good enough by itself this is actually uh, getting you somewhere with the Osmo Pocket Thank you very much for watching. I was Rotodil and I hope I'm gonna see you on my next video. I have some cool gadgets coming up, like I mentioned before, so definitely subscribe by clicking on this button and check out my other reviews over here. I'm putting three of these because I really like to do reviews of uh, camera gear and this is definitely one of them. So I hope I'll see you on one of these videos. Thank you very much for watching again. Bye-bye.